So this is something I've been wanting to explain for um, some time, how they do this like loop of um, attacks and one is always to relieve the other. So um, a moment ago, I called this um, car place. I mean, not this car place, but this tire place um, because I refuse to go through the stuff that um, Walmart is pulling. Um, so that was on Monday when we spoke and then I called today and he called me back and this, this you see the one, two thing. Okay. That's, it's always like, um, an enter and an exit. Okay. So like when they have no way to exit or either enter or lie about who did what they always like try to get right back out of the situation um so it means that they'll create two dialogues two phone calls two of any type of encounter all right so um the attack is right now um that they've been putting me in the lowest frequency and saying that i don't have any money based on my account my usaa account which i changed all my direct deposits from um effective the beginning of december and i was i just now they're attacking me speaking so i was in the middle of not even in the middle of i had just hit like place order okay um before that i made an order on amazon and it's probably still not showing let's see now it's showing so look but when I placed this order on Amazon, they didn't give me any of the information. So, like, that means the order wasn't showing here like it is now. Like, these things are showing here now. But they weren't previously. And I'm talking about, literally, soon as I made, and it's saying this is 19 minutes ago, I get this notification. He calls at the same time, and then they decline my payment for my purse. Okay, and now the decline isn't there anymore. Did I take a screenshot of it? I didn't. Okay, so it, it's like a loop. So when a lot of transactions or a lot of money, money is moving, like going out fast, they try to cover down on claiming it. And um, he called me back and he didn't even have a reason to call me back. And he was just like kind of stuttering around and trying to act like, you know, he had, um, he just couldn't um, remember whether or not he had the um tire there so i uh, you know it, it was an awkward um encounter because he really didn't have anything to say he was just trying to like um bullshit his way through you get what i'm saying so the issue is right now they're trying to set up for an attack no one can reach me directly okay like so this number here notice i don't have google voice anywhere anymore that icon the little green phone which is what i use for all my communications and now as a result of that they're not allowing me to get the email so like because i get emails of the same thing that transpires with the phone i didn't need the app in order to monitor it because it will come here see like say that i got a call but i've been deleting a lot of them trying to free up space so they um, are interfering with the email now because I won't put the app back on my phone. And that app always had like 200 something odd messages, okay? So that's between call, text, and voicemail. And they were using that to suggest that I was in contact with others. And every day something, someone hits that line, okay? Like, but it's always um, a matter of business. It's not a per any personal phone calls. So... The thing has been here recently how no one has this direct number and he, they were the preparation for setting up this attack was suggesting that I was in contact with someone and he calls me back. OK, in the middle of me making a purchase on my direct number. It's not a personal phone call. They're acting like I'm not conducting business.